So 16 or 17 months ago, I had announced that I was starting my own perfume brand. And at that time, I had no idea what was involved, how to begin such a project, who do you even call first? There's just so much going on. And, and it's taken us every single moment from then up until now to get us to exactly where we are, which is we're right about to launch. So I wanted to introduce you to Les Abstraits the abstract which is inspired by the art forms and i find perfume just as much an art form as any other be it painting poetry literature sculpting music dancing where it's the job of the artist to stir some sort of thought feeling or emotion deep within the observer that wouldn't be possible without and um, perfume to me is very abstract outside of the, the packaging, the bottle, um, the, the, the fragrance itself. Once you spray it, it becomes this invisible form where there is nothing to touch or grasp or even see. It, it's very invisible. And it, in its invisibility, it fills up all the space that you allow it to. And, you know, from observer to observer, we all kind of assign it meaning which can be very different from experience to experience and um you know given the colors the contrasts the shapes and the textures we allow it to be whatever it is we want and that's the beauty of perfume so as i was developing a logo for les abstrait i saw it inspiration in architecture and nature and I found it in both in um, old Italian 1500s art renaissance where the old gothic church cathedrals were this monstrous striking objects and I found them really beautiful and I was drawn to them and I was um, specifically attached to the quatrefoil and I found the same, the same form in, in um, the lilac flower last spring in my time outdoors meditating and connecting to earth. And there's these nature trails that I go on and there's these blooming lilacs every spring and they leave this, this wonderful aroma. And I kind of picked one up and I, I saw the form and it was the sh same shape as a quatrefoil. So I adopted it for my own. I had just taken that quatrefoil and turned it you know, to the side to more reflect on the letter E, intertwined E's, and I, I totally love it. And it's so me, and it's abstract at the same time, even though it's a figure, it's it's very abstract, and, and people can look at it and see different things. Um, you know, you see the quatrefoil, you can see a letter E, you can see a, a flower petal, and at the same time, all four points, they are turned to point inwards, sort of like... Um, an introspection, which is a theme the brand is going to focus on. So it's always going to be in our best interest to preserve the art of perfume, which is so meaningful to me. It's always going to be in my best interest to work with the greatest perfumers available to me at that given moment in time. And it's always going to be in my best interest to work with the greatest materials available to me in that given moment in time to create a really well-balanced conceptional and functional perfume and the three perfumes we've created up until now are so beautiful that i am extremely proud and excited to share with the world and we will continue to expand on creating even better perfumes and i am inspired by a very deep and meaningful connections to the self um, it, within introspection and self-reflection and going inside, silencing the mind and connecting to the body and emotions that we distract ourselves from. I am inspired by uh, digging out thoughts that are hidden below the veil of consciousness that... Um, that kind of linger and lurk about. I am inspired by a connection of God and love and consciousness flowing through the body of presence and awareness, which is really where 
the first three perfumes came from. I feel like I didn't create them. I feel like they came to me in the silencing of the mind and meditations. And, and I am just simply the messenger, you know, through my body, through my voice and through my perfumes, I am delivering the messages of these three beautiful perfumes. And that's how I want to continue creating is just through being connected to the self and the consciousness awareness present moment, which is a really beautiful thing. Very soon we'll be launching Les Ups today, The Art of Life. And in the next video, I'll tell you a little bit more about the perfumes. But before I go, I want to thank you all for your, your very positive support. It's been overwhelming. I've gotten a lot of help from a, a lot of you. This has been one of the most fulfilling projects that I've ever been a part of. It's actually been like a dream come true for me. I will share some links in the description. If you would follow Les Ups today on social media, I would be grateful. I'd also be grateful if you were to like this video and share it in some of your favorite social media fragrance groups. Thank you all for watching and we'll see you very soon.